Up to now, scientists thought that the trace amounts of carbon on the surface of the moon came from the solar wind. Now researchers at the Carnegie Institution's Geophysical Laboratory have detected and dated moon carbon in the form of graphite, the sooty stuff of pencil lead. They found a form of rolled graphite called graphite whiskers. This could only form in very high temperature reactions like impacts dating back to a heavy bombardment era 3.8 billion years ago. Carnegie scientist Andrew Steele is lead author of the study. His team analyzed moon rocks collected from the Mare Serenitatis impact crater visited by the Apollo 17 mission. Past researchers had found carbon only from the solar wind. Steele's team looked at thin rock slices and fresh surfaces using a mapping technique called confocal Raman imaging spectroscopy. The results were quite unexpected and exciting. Scientists now think that the moon could hold a record of materials like water and carbon that contributed to the rise of life on Earth. The research is published in the July 2, 2010 issue of Science. This is John Strom for the Carnegie Institution.